Hello and welcome to this week's episode of uh, Tech Tuesdays, this is your host Alex, and today we'll be looking at the disassembly and cleaning of the fan system of the Asus G75VW, uh, the specific model laptop, and mine is the uh, G75BBK5. Uh, this process works similarly for most of the other um, Asus gaming laptops in the G series, being like the G55, the G73. The G74, this G75, also the newer uh, G750. Um, just the disassembly of the newer model is a bit easier. Uh, so jumping right into it, I already took out the two screws, which are located right here. Kind of hard to see, but uh, there's one right here and there's one right there. Now taking off the panels is a bit of a hassle. So for that we'll just use um, use a butter knife, but I'll just use this knife. We're gonna slowly just pry this off. Being extremely careful not to break anything. Alright, it's just slowly gonna go. Right, let's get over here. There you go. There's that panel. And then we're gonna get the power panel. And then we're gonna get the far panel over here. But before anything we can zoom in on that. And you can see the hard disk drive spaces. Uh, this is the empty base. You can upgrade this button to second bay later. Over here is your RAM slot. Um, and tilting the camera up slightly forward. Ooh, yeah. Sorry about that. You can see the fan filter being held down by tape. Let's get that out of there. And as you can see, uh, it's covered in dust. Um, I cleaned my fans after every 1,000 hours of use. Uh, it's still not even like filled up all the way, but uh, you definitely do want to clean it because if you don't, the uh, computer will overheat and uh, that'll lead into problems. So let's get that panel over there and we'll take it to the next step. There we go. Alright, here's both of the fan filter, uh, filters. Alright, to clean these, we will use N-Dust. For electronics, I really do like this product. Um, it also comes with a bitterant uh, included, so... I mean, you wouldn't inhale this, because I guess it would burn. Anyways, um, let's get this little straw nozzle out. It'll attach it right here. And from there... You can spray clean uh, the dust out of this. Get the other side a little bit. That's pretty much clean. There's the other filter. And then another good thing to do, which you probably won't be able to see on camera is to go to the filter themselves and uh, spray into it and you'll see a lot of dust fl fly out through the vents
Oh, and that should do it. And then from here, I should have got the other angle, but uh, afterwards, uh, just need to put back each filter, and then uh, we can tape them down. The tape will just hold it in place. Alright, I'm going to put this back together, which is the same steps as before, and then for the last part of this video, I'll show you the fan filter, uh, I think it's called the fan filter checker program, and I'll show you how many hours in use it's been since you clean your fan. After you clean it, you just reset the program, so uh, we'll jump into that. Okay, and as the last part, we'll go to start, type in fan filter checker just pops up a fan. I use this for 1129 hours. We'll click here to reset the time usage since I just cleaned the fans. Press OK and it resets. And to check, we'll go back to fan, filter checker, and it'll show up as zero. Thank you for watching this episode of Tech Tuesdays and please turn, tune in next week to see the next installment of Tech Tuesdays. Thank <laughs> you.